Hello everyone. Today we will learn about Grammarly. Grammarly is a free writing app to make your online writing effective and this tool will really help you to write great content. So let's get started. Type grammarly.com on your browser. This is the window you will get. You can see an add to Chrome extension here. This plugin will help you to add Grammarly to your Chrome browser. Grammarly comes with many features that enable your readers to easily understand your text. You can integrate Grammarly with your emails, documents, social media and everything which is described here. Now, not just for your grammar and spelling, but Grammarly can also be used to eliminate errors and find words to express yourself. So now, let's click on add to Chrome extension button. This will redirect you to the Chrome web store for extensions. Click on add to Chrome and then click on add extension and you can see it's working. And now the plugin is added. Let's pin Grammarly to the browser by clicking on the pin icon. Next, you need to create an account in order to use Grammarly. So enter your email ID and password. Also create a username. You can also sign up using Facebook, Google and all. So click on sign up. Yes, your account is being created and now you have to do some configurations in your account. Now I am choosing work and click on continue. I want help with spelling and grammar sounding fluent. I am going with spelling and grammar. If you want you can click all of these, it totally depends on you. I want help identifying when I sound, you can choose and then click on continue. So here you can see the basic plans for Grammarly, free plans and premium plans. Free plans have only basic corrections and premium has more advanced features. So you can go premium with $11.6 per month. For now let's go with the free version by clicking on continue to Grammarly button. Let's skip the tour for now. So this is the demo document and you can see your errors underlined and suggestions to improve your text, misspellings missing s, effect to effect and blue underlines are for sentence corrections. So here you can see suggestions, a small description of it and if you don't want to change it you can dismiss the suggestion. You can also make your text bold, italic, underlined, give us headings as links and as bullet points. What you see here is the overall score, the number of characters, words, sentences, reading time, speaking time, word length, sentence length, readability score etc. Also you can download the report if you want. You can set your writing goals over here. You can also set level of correctness, clarity, engagement, delivery. If you use the premium version you could have more options to make your writing better. So let's add a new text. Click on new document. You can either paste a text here or upload a document. So let's upload. Click on upload, select a file and open. So here you can set your goals such as audience, formality, domain, tone. So for now let's set it to default. You can see the errors and suggestions I have mentioned earlier. We can also download the corrected file by clicking on the download option here. So you can see the file is being downloaded below. Now let's go to Gmail and see how Grammarly works on it. So you can see Grammarly is plugged in here and is working. Let me paste a text here. Grammarly has detected errors and are displaying suggestions and tone. You can open that and make necessary corrections. 
Now our email looks good. Let's jump into Google Docs and see how Grammarly works on it. Turn on Grammarly here to get it working. Paste content. Usually Grammarly appears on every corner of pages. Correct the mistakes and make your text much better. So as a whole, Grammarly is a very effective tool helping us to fix our errors in an easy, fast and convenient way. So if you are not good at writing great content, don't worry, you have this wonderful tool to help you. Since content is king in SEO, you can use tools like these to improve your writing for blog posts of your website. Wishing you all a perfect writing. Thank you.